Over 500 satellites have fallen from the sky, not from collisions or malfunctions, but pulled down by something far more powerful. Right now, a silent war is happening 340 miles above your head, and humanity is losing. Since 2019, SpaceX launched 8,873 Starlink satellites, creating the largest constellation ever designed to blanket the planet in high-speed internet. However, 1,204 of those satellites are already gone, with over 500 re-entries being completely unplanned. Something is reaching up from Earth, dragging them down one by one to burn in the upper atmosphere. What force is powerful enough to pull down satellites traveling at 17,000 miles per hour? The Sun. Our star is in solar cycle 25, approaching its solar maximum, the peak of the Sun's rage, and it's angrier than anyone predicted. Every solar flare and burst of charged particles heats Earth's upper atmosphere, causing it to expand like a balloon into the path of satellites. Suddenly, satellites cruising through near-vacuum plow through thicker air, increasing drag, dropping orbital velocity, and allowing gravity to take over. The satellites spiral inward, faster and faster, until they hit the dense atmosphere and disintegrate in a streak of fire. This is historic. Never have so many satellites been in low Earth orbit during such intense solar activity. SpaceX designed Starlink satellites to last five years, but many aren't making it past three. We can't cool the upper atmosphere or shield satellites from this scale of solar radiation. We can't negotiate with the sun. No matter how far we reach into the cosmos, the sun is still the king of our solar system and gravity always gets the final say. If you enjoyed this, don't forget to like and subscribe for more mind-blowing science.